Alright, Josh here, and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon VGC 2019 Battle Spot Live Series. Today we're coming on with Lunala and Groudon. Coming towards the end, we'll have two more episodes of it today and on a Saturday, and then we'll call it a day and run a team that can beat Eveltal, as this is, <laughs> this is struggling. Yeah. I think if anybody was to have a go with this team, I don't know how you could change it so Eveltal isn't a problem, because... Yeah, however way you really put this team, just the, <laughs> the combination of Ground on Lunala and, and Metagross are all um, very threatened by it. So, yeah, it, it does make it difficult. Um, three of your best, your three main Pokemon really threatened by one thing. Makes it rather difficult. So hopefully we don't play any Veltor today. That's the one thing I do want to play. Play more Xerneas. I've not played, we've barely played Xerneas. It's so weird. Like, nobody's running Xerneas anymore. I don't know. I really don't see Xerneas anywhere near as much as we have done. Um, which is quite odd. Because Xerneas is good against uh, Veltor. I'll tell you that for sure. Anyway, it's looking like we're going to be sat here a while. So we'll jump into game one. Yes, I found someone. This is taking so long to find people today. It's really... Okay. Clip. What do I do against this? Does anybody know? <laughs> um, Coco's good. I'm gonna be that crocodile. Oh, that crocodile's a pain. Oh, that crocodile's a real pain, isn't it? I don't have anything for that. How do I beat it? I'm not going to be able to. Um, I need to bring. I definitely need to bring Lunala. I definitely want Finny. Do I Groudon? Oh, I mean, Groudon's pretty good, isn't it? Is it? Is it? Or is Metagross better? Metagross or Groudon? Nah, Groudon. Nah, no, oh, actually, I don't know. Actually, I think I'm going to bring. Let's bring Metagross. Why not? I have no idea. Well, I, I do have a bit of an idea what's going to happen. I mean, I'm pretty pretty sure um, Lugia is going to be doing some Z Tailwind, Car Mind, Stall, Vulky, Roosty shenanigans. That's pretty much all Lugia does, really, isn't it? Um, so I'm pretty sure we'll, we'll see that, but other than that. Who guesses as good as mine? So I need to bring them all. Well, lo and behold, there's the there's the crocodile. Oh, it's not gonna be scarf, I reckon, is it? It is scarf. Oh, God. oh wait, well this is funny because I can uh, I can my guard. <laughs> oh, then you're not taking anything out. Wide guard dazzle? I don't, I don't see one. Are you gonna earthquake? Yeah, probably. I, I'd be very surprised if you didn't earthquake. You might just double Lunal though, that would be quite problematic. Ah, uh, Scarf Crocodile! Oh, that's actually an issue, isn't it? <laughs> Why is Crocodile an issue for me? It, it really shouldn't be, but it, it seems to be. I actually don't know how I'm gonna beat it. Do you, I mean, oh, he's still, oh, man. Don't be choice band. Choice band would be the worst thing, especially against Finny. That, that's the one thing I don't want to see. It, I don't want it to be choice band. Or swords dance, that'd be just too bad. I also. I don't think Dazzle will be a 2 hit KO on Crocodile. I, I'm hoping it is. It does EQ. Okay, well, that's a good start. Well, let's, let's put it that way. Let's, 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 I mean, it, it's locked into it at least, so. But if it choice band crunches Lunala, then we're kind of screwed. That fight to a KO. I'm just Dragon Sense. Okay. Lunala. Okay. Oh, that's not bad. Right. Um. Okay. This is. Oh, it's Life Orb as well. Okay. This is this is actually fine. Um. That's just Dazzle. I'm just White Guard again. Like. 
The chances are Crocodile's gonna switch out, but I, the, the, I don't wanna risk it. I can't. I can't risk it. But I should pick up if it does. I should pick up the Ray, which is quite nice. Is it Neg One? And it's Life Orb, so it's not very bulky. We saw how much Dazzling Gleam did. Like another one will pick it up. And I can always Bullet Punch. I did bring. I brought my Ghost and I could just Bullet Punch Crocodile. You see. Yeah, okay, they do switch out quick enough. Too many. But if, if Rain Dragon is in, it, 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 it dies. Oh, it's a double switch, actually. Interesting. Who are we going to? Drapey out. Oh, another annoying Pokemon that I can't beat. Um, we could double switch. At least Arnold Drapion's not a true scar. What is it? I, poison Dark. Right. Didn't even know it's type. Um, I'm going to Volt Switch the Drapion. Should we switch into Life any? I think you Poison Jab. I can tell, actually. Tailwind would be quite useful, actually, I think. I think Tailwind would be very useful. Like a stomping touch from Drapion. Yeah, let's go for that. Let's do that. That's something you don't see very often. Oh, I was going to say that to the lot. Okay, better. Better, 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 I don't know if Metagross actually sounds like that, I've no idea. I really like Shiny Metagross, I think it's really cool. It's so cool. Night Slash! Oh my god! It Night Slashed me. I'm, I'm not going to Mega Evolve yet. I'm going to wait. What should we do? Should we get rid of... I got Stomping Tantrum Drapion. Uh... I just don't want to intimidate, so... Hmm. The Bolt Switch, I suppose. Spinny coming in is still good because it threatens both Ray and um, Crocodile still, doesn't it? I just need to get rid of Crocodile. That's like the only thing, isn't it? If we get rid of Crocodile, we kind of the rest can sort of sort out the rest. Although Ray, we've seen Dragon Ascent, we've seen there's no Lugia, which is nice. We don't know what. I imagine the Z Wait, we could have two Z moves, obviously, but I imagine the Z moves only good. Okay, that's fine. Ish. A lot of damage. That's a that's a not a bulky finny, really, is it? That that did a lot more damage than I would have expected. What are you going for, Finny? Ooh. Flashbacks, horror flashbacks of back in the day. Uh oh. Right, I really hope Moonblast doesn't miss and kills this Drapion, because this will be very frustrating if not. All I need to do is get one Icy Wind off on Crocodile, and we win. One Icy Wind! So if I, I need to take a double K KO here, really. I've got one more turn of tail enough this. That's what I mean, if I take a double KO, Crocodile can't protect. So in theory... We should be okay. That's in theory. However, Moonblast might not KO. It has to be really close. I, I don't think... What night, is Night Slash gonna... Gonna get that growth? Like... 
taking the damn breaking up. Well, I hope this takes it out. It should do. Mi corazón, eh? Mi corazón. Right, well, this is a bit... Um, because now Ray comes back in, I would imagine you'd probably save Crocodile. I'd save Crocodile if I were you. Yep, that's right. Um, maybe Ironhead gets it. Or do you protect? You should probably protect. Ironhead. But I like to win just in case. Oh my god, if I miss Icy Wind on the Crocodile, that would be the that would be the worst thing ever. I, I that would be so bad. Yeah, that makes sense. That's sensible. I mean I could have left any alone, but I don't like any water. Just like Life Orb Dragonison on my Finny. It's going to be really close because I can live it, but I have taken Chip, which isn't great. Unless Metagross lives for an Earthquake. I don't know if I can live an Earthquake. I have to go for it. I, I can't switch in Coco, can I? My opponent did a good job of sorting out Tailwind. God, this crocodile's a pain, isn't it? It's not something I particularly <laughs> considered <laughs> team building. Mega Evil. I don't think Coco can live an earthquake. Come on, Mech goes. I need Mega Mech. I don't think he can. It's, you know, Crookedile's pretty good. He's got it. Oh, bulky Magmos is the best! Kill it. Oh, fast in the right. Oh, he actually KO'd it. <gasps> I can't believe this has happened. Bye bye, Penny. Oh, that was scary. Oh, that's why you run bulky Magmos, guys. That's exactly why. It's a critical hit. I'm actually faster than the right. That's, that's, uh. Well, that, that's just, uh. Oh, wow. Yeah, I think Iron Head's gonna. Well, we win now. Ooh. Still, that was terrifying. Um, yep. Yeah. Scarf Crocodile. Wow. It's not bad. I, I honestly think Iron Head should get Ray. And an extreme speed won't even get Coco. It should, well. I don't think so. I'm like max HP near enough. Oh, I am max HP, I can't even remember. I think I'm max HP. Or oh, one point off max HP for an odd number. I'm not really sure what the point in that protect was, but, you know, about each their own. I am on the head. Right. Kill it. Kill it. I need to go to the bank. What time does the bank show? Didn't even bother going to the extreme screen. Okay. Oh, maybe I have time to go to the bank. That would be ideal, actually. Maybe I just have time to run to the bank. If not, I'll go tomorrow. No, not tomorrow, sorry. Next week. I have time to go tomorrow, I'll be at work. That is one thing I've found quite handy. Although I work alternate weekends, I do have a day off during the week, which I have to say is quite handy for stuff like running to the bank and hmm, bits and pieces, really. There's an island kahuna. I don't think we've, have we ever had that. Probably, but not for a long time. Okay, we're back on track now. We're back on we're back on our winning track. Somehow took down that Krukal. If we missed that Moonblast on the Drapion, that would have been a lot more problematic. Like, very problematic. Also, I think that Rape was probably adamant. Just going off the fact that 
Metagross is out of speed, I'm not even max speed Metagross, so. <laughs> oh, it might not have been. Anyway, we'll jump into a game. Numero dos. Whoa, I just restarted and found someone super quick. With a bit of a classic team, I would suppose. With um, But with Stack Attacker, it's usually Among Us, isn't it? Um, I can't see my opponent bringing Stack. But you never know. But there is a Xerneas, so... Right. I usually go this against this. I usually bring Mr. Metagross and Mr. Finny. Or Mrs. Finny in the back. Metagross. It has no gender. It looks quite male-like, doesn't it, I suppose? Does Metagross have a gender? No, nope, didn't think so. It's, it's made of metal. But other metal Pokemon have genders, like Bronzong and stuff, don't they? So, why doesn't Metagross? Interesting. Um, yeah, I quite like this lead because, you know, I can either get the Z move off or I get... Oh, I see if my opponent leaves Xerneas in Cinnaroar. I either get a Swords Dance off or a Moon Met Raise off. Yeah, I, I just quite like that lead against this. Whatever happens, it's usually not too bad, you see. Let's go back. With the QR code. It's a good team, this. Like, it's, it's so solid. I like playing this team a lot. I won't ask Stack, though. I don't like Stack Attacker. I, th I think Stack Attacker's good, but it's not for me. It's not the one for me. I can't play with it at all. I'm terrible with it. Like a Moongus as well. I'm awful with that. You just have those Pokemon, don't you? You, just, no, you know are good and you are pre and you, you know you sometimes I struggle against Stack, but I just can't play it. With that Pikachu outfit. I love that. I imagine Intimidate plus Zernia, so... Mm, double Intimidate. Um, I mean, here I'm quite happy to Z-move Salmons and Sword Stance because the chances are you probably you either fake out Groudon and Tailwind or you Tailwind and Z Lunala, but so I either get a Soul Stance off or I KO the Salmons. If you get me. Do you, did that make sense? It's a lot harder to think out loud than in your head quickly. But uh, I feel like I'm going to go for this. I feel like we're okay with this. I potentially have to uh, cut la video. That's okay. I can, I can see Salmon's going for a, for a tailwind here. It's pretty, pretty obvious. Okay. No fake out. So that would say that that's a Z move into Lunala. I have to pause it twice. Uh, we're back. Okay, well this Salmon should be dead, really. Yep. And Incineroar is going for a Z move. That's the worst case. Z move is the worst case. U turns an okay case. Oh, it's U turn. Okay. I don't really mind this too much. Like, Incineroar can come back in now. If Incineroar and Groudon come in, that's not ideal. Hmm. And Incineroar? Side shock sword stance again. I'm just gonna sword stance again. Why not? Cross or tailwind. Tail. Oh, wait, how many turns of my opponent's tailwind are left? Two, three. Mm -hmm. I mean, you fake out Geomancy probably, or kill Lunala Geomancy. Do I want the chip? I think I want the chip. I think I want the chip. I'm going to try and tell them before we finish, though. So. 
Oh my god. I did not expect it to have Geomancy. Mm -hmm. Reckon Pressive Ice. It should do a nice bit of damage to Xerneas anyway. It's more than a nice bit of damage. I'm going to press this. And I'm going to try and Tailwind. If I, if I, 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 I'm not going to lose Groudon, unless it's a crit. I'm not going to kill Incineroar. Or I'm not going to kill Xerneas, but it might be in Bullet Punch range. Especially if Lunala gets an attack off. I should be into Groudon. Oh, it's into Lunala. Interesting. I 100% agree with that. Oh, I hope that didn't end up mattering. Ugh, for goodness sake. Ugh. Damn it! Ugh, that's annoying. Oh, yeah, let's go! <laughs> oh, no. This game is too much! Ugh. Right, okay. Um... I would imagine that Groudon is my opponent's last Pokemon. So I'm gonna bring out Metagross. I really needed that chip on Xerneas though. Which is quite annoying. Could have done, I really could have done with that chip on Xerneas. I would have felt a lot better about this, but... I mean, I can live a plus two... Oh, I hope this ground isn't special. That's the other thing. We're just not going to know. Ideally here, Xerneas will protect. But I think you're better off just Precipice Blading and Dazzling Gleaming. Which probably gets Finny. Which is not ideal. Yep, no protects. Yep. And Precipice? Oh, it's Eruption. Hmm, so it's special. Ah, uh, that's not ideal. Finny lived. Okay, I mean, this isn't over. If I... Oh, he's Metagross, so aren't I? Off on that damn Xerneas. Ah, I won't be too bothered. Um, well, ah, I think we lose. Because it, especially because it's special, it's probably like really fast rather. Which is too much to deal with right now with what I've got left. No protects. Start enough. I'll die to that. And I'll die to eruption. Oh, he's Earth Pearl. How to EV? How to EV? Right, um. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Think! 
Um, I'm still in a bad spot. <laughs> I'm still in a bad spot. Like, I still don't think I can win. I could double protect to see what my opponent does. Like, Isernius protects. I'm tempted to double the Garland, but their Garland's faster. That's that's the issue. Like, that's the hard bit. Although, my Megros is faster than their Garland, so if. Mm, I don't know. Oh, well done, Megros. Well done. Good Metagross. Mm, I still. Okay, right, well that's good. We had a chance to win it. It, it was this way, I guess. I went for eruption, actually. Oh man, if I press this blade it then. Well. We might be. We might, I don't know. It's, it's going to come down to it. I mean, I don't. I don't think I can live in a, an Earth Power from that range. I can live in Earth Power with Garden, but if I'm full, I've taken what 55 HP. <sighs> yeah, I don't think I can live it up eruption. You've got an Earth Power, Groudon. Like 100 percent. You have to. Yeah. You lose if you don't. Yeah, nah. I, there's not really much you could have done there, and, and, and there was a. Yes, mm, that's annoying. An opposing ground, yeah, that was a bit of an issue, wasn't it? Fast. Fast special ground was a bit of a, a pain. That does so much. It's so frail. But it's so bloody fast and offensive. It's just a. It's, it's hard to deal with with your own ground on. And Metagross. <laughs> but I, I need Metagross to beat. To be, um... We didn't get lucky with that crit on the Incineroar, but I, honestly, I think I would have rather taken the chip on Xerneas. Because it, it would have helped with Bullet Punch. Maybe we could have got a bit of speed control with Finny later on. It's hard to say. But never mind. Bad Groudon. Naughty Groudon. But Metagross did alright then. Actually, Metagross did clutch then. Living, living on 1 HP against... Yeah, that was actually really good. Good good old Metagross. How many games have we played in today's episode? Check quickly. So I can't remember. Okay. This will be the last one, would it not? Well, we're not having training version one. Do you have training version two? I don't even know what that goes like. I probably will do it as soon as it comes in. Anyway, we'll jump into game three because taking forever. Okay, okay, you found someone. Didn't have to reset either. Oh, with this team. Well, at least I know what this team does. At least I know what this team does. So, definitely want Lunala, but oh, it is Choice Ban Ray though, isn't it? Oh, that makes it more difficult. I guess Smeagol's not bad here. Let's go. I, I, I need Groudon. I don't want to bring it really, but I'm gonna have to. <laughs> I'm gonna have to. Oh, how am I going to beat Gastrodon? Dunno, let's just go for it. Oh my god. Locking in rapid. A Kaiser. Call that name. I don't know what it means, I don't know. But it's uh It sounds pretty cool. And I've dropped my pen. I've found my pen. Oh look, it's that lead I've never seen before. Um I'm 
going to do this. Oh, but this team is a bit different, isn't it? Because they usually have Gastrodon. Do they usually have Finny? I thought they just had Gastrodon. Wait, Ray, Insin, Solgaleo, Gastrodon. And this was what, Finny? Who was the other? Wait, I don't think they usually have Finny, do they? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they do usually have Finny, and I just don't know about it. I can't believe it. It's so, it could be water MT, that's why I'm... So I'm swapping Groudon in and faking out the, um, the Finny. The Groud, the Incineroar, worst case, it sees my Groudon, but I'm pretty sure it's Z, Solgaleo. I just snarls, it's fine. Whatever. Whatever, man. Um. Oh, yes, let's go. Right. What are we thinking? There's two things we can do here. There's two there's two plays. One is that we just follow me away whatever water type attack of Vinny's about to shoot out. Or we protect Groudon and spore the Incineroar slot because Ray's gonna come in. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Big read. Hmm. Okay, maybe not. But I'm quite surprised Ray didn't come in there. If there was ever a time to bring in Ray Quaza, that was it. Hmm, that's probably swords dance actually. Sorry, I'm going. Now's the time to bring in Ray. Oh, but do you bring it in now? For Finny? Oh no, I've screwed up. Oh wait, I've just, I've just really messed up. I didn't even think about it. I've, I've just like... Oh no, it's fine, there's no Ray, but of course there's a Ray. It's gonna... Oh, just lost ground on. It's gonna come in for the Finny. And he's gonna surf. That's what's gonna happen. I made a mistake. I, I made a mistake there. Damn. <sighs> I knew it. Oh, oh no, it's incineral. Okay, we've not made a mistake yet. So what's the kind of the ray? Oh okay, this is this is fine. Oof. We got a bit lucky there, to be honest. You gotta be lucky. Oh, we gotta be lucky there. Double protect. Well, oh, you know, protect spiky shield. Smiggle, Smiggle got an evasion move boost, isn't it? Just the one? Okay, no switches, that's kind of nice. I didn't, I didn't want Ray coming in, that would have been a pain. Go on, pick out my Smiggle, just for fun time's sake. Is he just ground him, Zeke, Gastron? Hmm. Moody, 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 moody! <laughs> what is going on? Um, your accuracy is up. My speed's down. Okay, right. Interesting. Let's pressy pice and follow me. Yeah, follow me, mate. Gray. Oh, there he is. There's the boy. And now he's gonna surf. Now you're gonna flipping surf, and I lose. 
Well, well at least he hit gas for them, otherwise they're gonna die. Oh, no it's not! Oh, so close! Oh, let's go Smeagol! Speed. I think it's choice plan three. <sighs> Which I don't like at all. I can't deal with it. I really can't deal with choice plan three, especially when crunch one shot with the olive. Oh god, it depends what you lock into it. Because if you lock into let's let's see. So funny. Oh god, Smeagol's saving me here, isn't it? Oh, that was a crit. No, it's not a crit. I might not neg one. Is it not neg one? <laughs> Wait, are we at plus five or plus six? Wait, I feel so bad for my opponent here. They've played this better than me. Also, no one will rate, I don't think it's choice band. That actually helps quite a lot. <laughs> That's so funny. Sorry. <laughs> Apologies to my phone. Oh, yeah, plus, <laughs> plus five. Oh dear. Are we at neutral, Groundhog? Oh, yeah, I'm at neutral. Okay. That makes more sense. Um, I'm still scared of a water type attack, though. Although. <sighs> Let's just go for it. Whatever. Let's go damage. Smeagol. It's so funny. <laughs> Sorry, it's so bad. I feel so bad when Smeagol gets his oh, I mean, that's fair. <laughs> it's not fair. I bet my opponent's absolutely raging at the other end of this. It's so bad. <laughs> Smeagol's so bad. Well, I mean, it's so good, but like, it's so, so frustrating. I mean, it's, it's just horrible, isn't it? It's horrible to play against. Oh, Smeagol. <laughs> I hope you're not legal next year. Well done. Gets the smiggle. Well, we know he's at choice, which is really nice. <laughs> so we've got defense boots. Oh no, that's so bad. <laughs> so bad for my opponent. Horrific. This is 2k on fitting. No. Oh, Smeago. You're putting in the finest of work. I, I think I'd have rage quit by now, to be honest. Hmm. You got me. Is that my dead Smeagol? Well done, Smeagol. You, you did well in this match. <laughs> it did so well. It just did all the work. So, uh, there's only one thing left to do, and that's Icy Wind, and then we'll go to Gravity and destroy everything. So it's Icy Wind first. We just see a... Oh, okay. I like, I'm gonna kill the guest room. This is fine. As long as I get an Icy Wind on the ray, I'm not bothered. I should, I deserve to miss it really on Ray. Quite quite a lot. I definitely deserve to miss. I should pick up the Gastro on there. Yeah, this is this is just a simple gravity press press play now. Like I don't think there's anything I can really do about it. Is that pretty faster than my guard on? No it's not, is it? No. 
this is over. Definite apologies to my opponent. If you happen to be watching, I do, I do apologise about Smeagol's shenanigans there. It wasn't fair, really. But again, again, Smeagol, Smeagol, isn't it? It, it? it happens. Most of the time it just dies quickly, but the odd time, it is a nightmare. Unless Stephanie goes first and we've been speed tying or something silly. No, that's game. I should take out both, really. Yeah. Yep, yeah, I do apologise about Spiegel shenanigans, but, you know, it happens, doesn't it? It happens. That was a scary game, just because there were several times where I thought Granum was going to die to our water type move, but we never saw any water type moves come out. This, I, I, I really, yeah, Ray, Rayquaza and water types are always tough to play against with Groudon. It's, it's always, it's just that mind game, isn't it? Are they going to switch into Rayquaza or are they, what are they going to do? So, yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching this episode, guys. Take it easy, and I'll see you all in a bit.